reading from the Gospel according to Mark. Chapter 1, verses 40 to 45. A leper came to him and kneeling down begged him and said, If you wish, you can make me clean. Moved with pity, he stretched out his hand, touched the leper and said to him, I do will, be made clean. The leprosy left him immediately and he was made clean. Then, warning him sternly, he dismissed him at once. Then he said to him, See that you tell no one anything, but go, show yourself to the priest and offer for your cleansing what Moses prescribed that will be proof for them. The man went away and began to publicize the whole matter. He spread the report abroad so that it was impossible for Jesus to enter a town openly. He remained outside in deserted places and people kept coming to him from everywhere. Words of the Holy Father This is how Christ fights the world's maladies and suffering, by taking them upon himself and conquering them with the power of God's mercy. In the face of a poor or sick person, we must not be afraid to look him in the eye and to draw near with tenderness and compassion and to touch him and embrace him. I have often asked this of people who help others, to do so looking them in the eye, not to be afraid to touch them, that this gesture of help may also be a gesture of communication. We too need to be welcomed by them. A gesture of tenderness, a gesture of compassion. Let us ask you, when you help others, do you look them in the eye? Do you embrace them without being afraid to touch them?